Hey everyone, this is Josh Galvin with Tizish.com. On this video tutorial, I'm going to show you how to correct an error with your Facebook comments that you see here. So, this is an example site right here. So, you see how this is telling you there's an error with the Facebook comments where it says it's unreachable? If this is the case, that means one simple thing that the Facebook app ID that you have signed up to this web to your website URL isn't registering that website URL which means all you have to do is go into your Facebook app that you had originally created and make sure that your URL exists in the system here's what I mean by that so first go into your admin panel to go find the specific section we're talking about so in your admin panel scroll down all the way to Facebook social plugins or the FB social plugins doesn't matter so after you click on FB social plugins you'll be on a page just like this on this page click on this link here that says don't have one easily get one here that's gonna that's gonna open up a page just like this and on this page here click on the button that says my apps now on the my apps button um, on the right hand side you're gonna see a list of all of your apps so click on the one that you're that is specifically your website URL so I'm gonna do this one for instance the demo tizish one and at this point once this page comes up that shows your that shows the the what the app that you chose click on edit settings and then here in the edit settings click on the website button and then here's what you need to make sure most likely on yours you're gonna see it like this you're gonna see it blank something's gonna be messed up or or either or maybe you have a different site URL or site domain something regardless of what you have here's what you need to have alright so on the Facebook app ID that you put into this section here as well as the one that you put into your Facebook comment section as well as the one you put in your Facebook comment section basically here's what you need to do you need to just basically make sure that your website URL is the one that shows up here and all you gotta do is just type it out so HTTP your website URL and then end it with the slash so on this line make sure it just has your website URL ending with the slash and under site domain simply enter your domain name just like that so so if your website if your website was it was uh, named John Doe real estate then this URL would be HTTP colon slash slash John Doe real estate dot com and then a slash and then on the site domain it would just be John Doe real estate dot com so copy this exact style that you see but with your respective URLs and then click save changes after you, after you do that it's going to it's gonna tell you it'll take a few minutes and now that kinda of error that you see here will be fixed basically because now that app ID will be associated to your URL alright so uh, let me know if you have any questions if you have any questions then go to facebook.com forward slash tizish the way you see tizish spelled here alright good luck and take care